You can also add in rich text inside of a video clip to have more control over the text that you display out. So to do that, you can select out a clip right here and then you can go to filters and click on the plus button. And over here in the search area, I'm going to go around and type in text right here. So once I do that here, you can see that uh, rich text is an option. So if I were to click on this, then this is what you have. So now what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to go around and then click on the rectangular box right here. That is what I have to do in order to start time typing directly onto the rich text box right here. I can resize this out uh, whatever I want and I can click and drag this over here as well. I can select out the text and I can bold this, I can italicize this or underline this as you can see right here and you can go around and here you can see you can even save out the files right here just like this you can even save out the file as a separate SDML file over here. So you get all the controls right here and another thing that you can also do is you can insert out table right here that even uh, that is even you can work around with the border and your rows and columns right here and as you can see that the text is very rich you can go around and then uh, right let's say for example press enter here you can see the rows um, of table as well so you can see that this is really a rich text right here you can underline these you can like let's say for example choose around a different font over here as well just like this and choose around the font size as well. So once you do that, you can go around and select out, let's say, for example, a particular color of text right here. You can center align like each and every um, like line right here. You can left align it. You can even justify it, meaning you can go around and let's say, for example, I'm going to say welcome to Tutor Tube right here. So let me just go around and press Control C. Uh, paste this out so you can see that I got welcome to tutu tube text right here just like this so let me just go around and arrange this and you can see that I can left align it center line it or justify it over here as well so you can go around and work around with the indentation as well over here so let's say for example if I were to indent it you can see that there's a bit of gap on the beginning and you can work around with these as well so you can um, minimize or expand out the tools that you see over here as well. So here you can see the presets for like lower thirds and slide in from left and so forth right here. So all of these options are here as well. You can make it full screen right here. You can work around with the position of the text right here. You can work around with the background size right here as well. And you can work around with background color over here as well. So if I were to go around, you can see that I can work around with the background color over here. And for the overflow, you can go around, make it visible uh, or invisible. So you can see that there's an overflow. It's visible. You can go around, make it hidden or make it automatic right here, uh, whether it'll be visible or uh, not. So you can see that visible or hidden. You can see that you can control out all of these settings in this text um, uh, filter right there. So that is how you can add in and work with the rich text inside of Shotcut. So hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.